freaking that Zeno <laughs> every time he pulls yep. up. Clipping yeah. light at that. He did some. I, I've never even seen. Maybe Tweak has done it. I've never seen Tweak do this. But he does that uh, up B cancel jump into, into the aerial. Air. Yeah. Whatever he wants. And like, that was how he, he won just had people slipping. Like, that joint is wild. All right. Anyway, let's get into this game. And this is. So these two are. To say that they have experience against each other is an understatement. Oh, They've been sure. experiencing with each other since the womb. Bro. Sort of. He used to, look, his older brother, I don't know how much older than him he is, but listen, he used to babysit him. He has to take orders in the house. <laughs> this is a chance for revenge. Exactly. I bet, like, I bet this, it must have been like back in the day, it was just like, you can, yeah, you can get like the thing if you beat me in Smash first. <laughs> and that's why Quinn got so good. Mm -hmm. But it's so it's so it's so good to have a really good training partner right in your house though. <laughs> oh yeah. Charles should never lose to a Pokemon trainer and Quinn should never lose to a snake. This is this is it. <laughs> Nonetheless, this game looking pretty even, because like this is snake. He's heavy. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, there's that upbeat cancel you were talking about. That one just makes the movement and the recovery so yeah. cheeky. <gasps> Bro, let me just tuck you in real quick. <laughs> Let me just tuck you in hey, real bro. quick. I promise there's no monsters under the bed. <laughs> he lied. <laughs> they I'm were sorry. over the bed. The <laughs> monsters came Yo. from the bottom, dude. So I guess you didn't lie. This just came from the, <laughs> through the ceiling. Like, bro. <laughs> Man, but just like that, as we're laughing at this situation, quit able to even up the stocks. Yeah, no, and it, it, it does, I will say, when when Charles is doing well, uh -huh. it does still feel like he has to really work oh, hard. Oh, you know what I mean? 100%. 100%. Like, he's having to make galaxy brain plays just to keep it even. Mm -hmm. But right now, he's doing more than keeping it even. He actually has a straight-up yes. lead right now. A pretty good lead. Yeah, this especially is. with Snake. But that up air is the bane of, sing of a Snake's existence in this matchup. Once he gets above Snake, it's like, bro, you're just frame trapped until you die. And don't forget the down air, which mm, is forced to yes, recover low. Yes. Both of those spore explosions mm -hmm. just ruin, absolutely ruin Snake in disadvantage. Yes. That being said, he's been keeping himself out of disadvantage. He's getting on some nice Ooh. damage, but as I say that, now he's off stage, forced to recover super yes. duper high end. Mm, there you go, up air. He probably thought he was going to scout out the air dodge, so he decided, listen, let me just get straight to this platform if I can. But no, he's like, listen, you're not safe. You are not safe. Okay, good get up attack. Gonna reset the neutral here. Yeah. Oh. Now Charles doesn't want to take too much damage. Like, this is not a good situation for you to be in, even as Snake. Nice, and that's true at 140. Yep, and if he grabs him again, of course, 160 is that beautiful uh, yes. little sort of the snake percent. Yeah, and there it is again. Two stocks taken from those up smash ledge traps, basically. And it's crazy, because as good as Snake is, I think, yo, if he doesn't have that 160 and 140 confirmed, he drops significantly on the tier list. Oh, like, yeah. Yeah, it, it, it becomes extremely hard for him to kill, especially against somebody who played Brawl and understands how grenades and C4s work. Like, how are you getting your, your stop if they're not running into an up tilt? It's, I, I feel like after, like, the one... If he's not able to get a grab at 160, then it's, like, late back air is his mm -hmm. best kill. Option. Yeah, and now you're fishing because that move is not... Uh, has a lot of... Oh, that hit? I, I'm that not going to lie. I'm a little upset that one hit, too. His head was way below the ledge. <laughs> and it's like, okay, so in right there, quit freaking new. Mm -hmm. He charged that down smash way before the air dodge came out, mm -hmm. way before he could have possibly reacted to it. Even though he does have very good reaction time, that was just anticipation. He knows yeah. his brother. He knew that Snake was going to be air dodging to the ledge right there, and he picks his option just perfect. Yeah. Really good, man. When I first started watching Quid, listen, PT, another character that's like, ah, eh, for me. Hate, hate fighting PTs in brackets. But I look at his PT, it's extremely intentional. You could tell oh, that he's yeah. in the training room. He's labbing not just his combos on specific characters, uh, not just his combos on the whole cast, but specific characters and understanding what he can and can't do. And it's really nice to watch, man, especially his Squirtle. Oh, yeah. I mean, his Ivysaur is kind of the one he's known for. Mm -hmm. Mostly, I would say because of his brother. Like, mm. when you when your main training partner is a snake, you are going to spend most of your time learning how to play Ivysaur. Yeah. That is very true. Yeah. Yeah, this is sort of actual familiarity, trying to do some cheeky things here on FD. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So dropping in and everything. So far, hasn't really actually granted any big wins in neutral, but nonetheless. Ooh. And and that's the thing. When you're playing against, when you're watching the match versus two people who have played each other for so long, they do things. He didn't get it. He won the lock, right? 
oh, insane. Yeah. They end up doing things that we kind of go, why did he do that? Like, why did he do this move instead of this? And it's like, bro, they've been playing each other for so long, they know. Okay. I can't believe that dash attack missed. And that was a pivotal miss because yeah. all of a sudden... Are you dead for it? No. But you have no air dodge. Hey, it's dead, yeah. dude. No air dodge. <laughs> yeah. And forced to up B at that super duper awkward range. Quid just goes out there to meet him. And oh no, he has no Great jump. Cypher! This is bad. Now you're taking damage. Oh, oh at 50? No. You thought he was taking damage? You see, he take it to the floor. He was at 53. <laughs> Yo, that was pretty wild. But I mean, he did have 140 rage. But I mean, still, that's the That's the snake. That was 53. Uh, it was his fault. Salty. For, it was his fault for getting hit. Why would you get hit at 50, oh, dude? Yeah, I mean, it's not like <laughs> this is my stage. What, what are you trying to do? Play the game? <laughs> How dare you? How dare you try and play the game? Mm, okay. Charles kind of dropping these confirms here. He's getting uh, Quid to run into these grenades, but Quid's not taking a lot of damage after the fact. Oh, that's gonna be so. Bro. <laughs> oh, Yo, I want. He was at 77, so he may have died again. Oh, yeah. I mean, if he was dying at 50, I wouldn't be surprised if he dies right there. But, like, okay. Look at the pressure he's trying to put yeah, on. Yeah, this is so good, man. Look at it. Very methodical with his uh, with his placement. Okay. Oh, this could be big. Okay. He's a good situation. Uh, nice. Great situation. He was able to take that stock with the Nikita. That was very important. Oh, yeah. No, be that if... If that percentage had gotten any more than this, like he's at 84 right now, meaning he doesn't have to be scared of that yes, much. Yes, definitely, yeah, yet. for sure. He can play the way he wants to be, at least for just a little bit longer. Now it's starting to get a little yeah. more scary. Now you're in disadvantage, Quid's kind of reacting instead of doing preemptive moves. Like, now you kind of feel like he's in your head. You got to be, uh, kind of got to stay solid here if you're Charles. Ooh, but the damage is racking up. Forced to switch to Ivy mm -hmm. Sword, looking for a kill right here. Mm hmm. And I'm not. Whoa, okay. It's so scary. Every time he gets touched, it's like Ivy could delete you. That was so smart. The grab armor. Please, the grab armor. Now 172. I he, feels like. This is bad. He lost neutral once and he's taking 120%. 189. Yeah. And is that enough? Yeah, it's going to be that it. That is it. So I was like, I'm telling mom. Yeah. <laughs> I'm out of here. You're taking garbage out tonight. <laughs>